All right, let's try another one. Now that being said, I've never done this dog before. This might not be a good idea. <laughs> and if it ends up not being a good idea, I'll turn the camera off. But she's obviously been done before. Oh yeah. The people who have this dog say she was found at the lake, just as a stray, and they never could find the owner, which probably means she was either put out or she came from a kennel situation. And they think she's an English cocker. I hate to break it to them, she's a pretty American cocker. Mm -hmm. She's actually a really nice looking little dog. Oh yeah, she's used to being done. Mm -hmm. When they got her, she was a seven all over from the sounds of it. I mean, she was really short. She might have been shorter than that, but whoever found her had her groomed and then gave her to them when they couldn't find the owner. And she looks like she might have had puppies at one point. She's a pretty little girl. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I can't find this kind of stray. I end up with Prunella. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, Prunella is either a hound mix or a pit mix that somebody put over the fence at my house during Hurricane Michael. And that's the second time she's been at my house, but this time she's staying. Apparently. So if anybody wants a cute little mutt, her name is Prunella, give me a call or message me. You can have her. I don't need her and I'll want her. I didn't want her the first time. I don't want her the second time. She doesn't like my older dogs. She doesn't need to be at my house. Alright. I'm going to say this dog has most definitely had puppies looking at her belly. And what I'm going to do is start a copper pattern. She said trim her up, but there is no trimming this up. The girl who owns these dogs is a little nutty. Billy started on McKenna, who's a palm, right before I started on her. So. And that palm is getting a seven all over with a rock. So. Don't shoot us. Don't send us hate mail. What the client wants. What the client wants. The client's going to get it. And it hasn't affected his dog's hair wounded. It really hasn't affected her soft coat at all because she has crummy hair anyway. Really still, crummy still. hair. She had crummy, crummy, crummy hair before we ever cut her short, and all it's done since then has gotten crummier. It's actually thickened up, thickened as up. opposed to the opposite of what you would think. It's actually gotten thick, but it's a weird texture. Hello. Very soft. Um, give me just a second. Did Brian just go outside? Yeah. See if you can get him to come in. Because this is the German short hair pointer and. The English, or the Chihuahua. Sorry. Brian's going to be right with you. I don't know anything about this puppy to leave her alone or not. I don't know if she'd stay here or not. desk is not that far away from my table. I would have walked up there to take care of her if I knew that the dog was going to behave. I don't know. I would have put a rear loop on her with Billy sitting right there and walk to the desk, but I don't know the dog, so I'm not going to risk it. Yeah, I'm not going to take that chance. Now, if it was my cat, it'd be no problem. Put a rear loop on her, me standing right here, you could walk anywhere you wanted to, and it would be fine, because we're literally three feet away from each other, maybe four feet away from each other. With a dog that I don't know, I'm not going to chocolate, you end up with softer hair. Mm 
And I don't know if he told you, but we did get some pictures today. And we actually got pictures of both of them, if you can believe that. So, we did. We got them. So, She's behaving this well. She's really doing good. She's doing better than some of the conferences we do on a regular basis in here. She hasn't been done in months. I mean, they've had her four or five months. So. She actually had them booked in, her booked in rather, for an appointment about a month ago. And then she called and said, no, they weren't bringing her. Brought the others and not her. Or actually, didn't call, just didn't bring her. Got here and said, oh, no, we didn't bring her. This leg goes on the table. Just common sense things like that. Will make your grooming a lot easier. The dog doesn't want to put its leg down. Sometimes I'll lift the other leg, or if it's fighting me when I'm holding it up and I can work on it sitting down, I will do that. I don't fight them. It's not worth it. I'll find a way to make it work. There's lots of tricks. I just want to take off all those long, straight, scraggly hairs underneath. Because the pattern is going to grow, probably not going to ever grow out, but knowing these people, it won't. But we're going to do it today. Because the instructions I was given were just make her cute and trim her up. Well, okay. I can do that. Yeah, they have. 
I'm really glad. I thought for a few minutes I was going to cry there earlier. Oh, we may be crying again. No crying and dog running, but it was pretty bad for that. Tell you they were like night cramps and which you get in your feet sometimes. Mm -hmm. yeah, but it's not nighttime. Yeah, not here anyway. That's a beautiful <laughs> Billy and I have been working together so long that we know what the other person's going to say before they ever say it. And we know that what we just said is going to exhibit, or excuse me, extract X response. We already know what's fixing to be said based on what we say. And a lot of times we can just say it for ourselves. And we understand some really stupid stuff. Did you put them? Thank you. Uh, you ain't the only one that can't talk lately, though. I haven't been able to talk. You haven't been able to talk. Brian hasn't been able to talk. Yeah, it's been pretty bad in here. Liz has had her chair troubles tripping over her own phone. It's still not as bad as last week when I couldn't spell certification to save my life. <laughs> Can't leave it have nine. The th part was not, was not there. Certification. certification. Every time. That's more good. Certification. <laughs> certification. That's more good. And it was every time I wrote it. I mean, and I think I was trying, I think it must have been 15 times in the article I was writing. It was spelled wrong every single time. I do like predictive text on the cell phone. It saves you from that. Computer doesn't have that yet. I don't know that predicting text always tries to put everything and I'm not trying to put it. <laughs> <laughs> that's not where I'm Well, going. no, you're, you're talking autocorrect. I'm talking predicting text. No, I, I wonder. I don't know what it does. You know, I mean, I'm thinking anyway, because it's like the right emails, it puts word in when you put the first That's autocorrect. And I'm like, no. Yeah, that's autocorrect. I have that turned off. Yeah, I can't stand it. Don't like that it's not what I'm trying to no, say. I have that turned off. Hello. Give me one second. Hang on, baby girl. She's here for the little chihuahua puppy. Can you get her? Yes. It's 15. Tell her didn't you know? She right back over there. Hi, how are you? It's 15. Okay. You can bring it here. Hang on one second. Bring all of it here. Oh, Billy. He's being difficult. He knows how to do that. He doesn't want to do that. Aww. He knows how to run that machine. Not the new one. It's the same as the old one. Which way is the car going? Facing you, chip down. Okay, facing me, chip down. Yeah. Put $15 in. You got it? I'll figure it out. Okay, and then... $15 for a puppy. Watch him. This is not going to be a traditional car. This is just going to be a... On the Facebook page in a little bit. Stop, 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 stop. And just so you know, it's swipey, wouldn't you? Well, it's easy enough. And then Brian told me he didn't find one else. No, it doesn't have an option. You could have just brought me the machines. I could have done it. They're both, they're both cordless. That was too easy. I know, but they are both cordless. So you can bring them to me. Stop. Stop that, girl. She does not like her head going. You can drop her. Well, what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a 
I'm not doing a traditional crown where mm -hmm. it's longer. Right. I am going to leave hair. I'm going to clean out the stock real good. Doing a modified summer show but I'm going to. So I'm not doing a modified <laughs> summer show clip. <laughs> We still don't know what that is. So if anybody knows what a modified summer show clip is, PM me, message me, Debbie Hilly at Gmail. Yes, suppose I don't even know what it is. Because we don't know what it is, and we'd really like to know. We never did see the client back, so we obviously didn't do it right. Definitely not. We don't know what the heck it was. But you know, it's that modified summer show clip. And all we could do was go, okay. Didn't know show clips came in summer and winter lengths, personally, but, you know. By blowing on it, sometimes you can see if it's coming forward or not, and it's not, so we're in good shape there. It's not going to fall over her eyes. She has a nice rounded top skull, but it's not so long that it's going to come down in her face at any point in time. And now these are the not the good ones to continue to swap with. Where's my others? Those are so fine that they're not going to allow me to blend the way I want to. And I was going to card her. I know I said I was going to earlier. I'm not going to do it. I'm just not going to do it. She doesn't have the texture to do it. And it's not going to help me in any way, shape, or form. It's not going to smooth out what I've done or anything like that. So I'm not going to do it. I'm going to get my, my blend lines a little bit better. And then I'm going to take a blade and go over her back. The reason I used the back was to pull off some of that excessive length and get it set real quick. And one thing I have learned is that copper hair looks better from a distance than it does up close. Every time. Even on a show dog, it looks much better from a distance than it does up close. Every time. I'm always shocked when I get up on top of one that even Mike and Linda Pitts have done and go, ooh. So then you go, what the heck just happened? That looks so good from over there. And then you get closer and, yeah, not so much. Okay, so. I think her blending looks pretty doggone good, actually. Mm -hmm. She is pretty. I like her. Oh, and I do have. <laughs> I do have a bolt without the back system in here. I wasn't sure I did. Mm -hmm. Okay, that one's not taking anything off. So, switch to the five and see what happens. Yep, that's the one I want. I use a couple with the vat, so I hide the out just to pull up anything long and fuzzy. Okay, I'm just going to dremel nails. Okay, you dremel nails. I'm not going to dremel nails. I just want to do nails because it's going to be hard. That's fine. And one thing I do to save time, though, is I'm using a wide blade. That does help tremendously. It doesn't have as many overlaps. You end up with much fewer lines. And because you have fewer overlaps, there's less chance of having um, ridges that you're going to have to go back and fix later. <laughs> now notice that I'm not coming down the sides. The coat comes this way, so I'm going to come and blend it in this way. And then when you get here, it sort of turns that way. So I move my arm that direction. Here, it comes this way. Here, it comes this way. Here, it starts to go down the sides. And if you'll just follow the lay of the hair, don't get me started singing that song again. <laughs> song to the follow the yellow brick road to, then you won't have any problems blending without having to go behind and using thinners extensively. I'm going to have a couple of spots. Yeah, I'm going to Okay. She has a mammary tumor, this one does. Okay. Yeah, they mentioned that to them. Good All right. I think we're both just about done. Yep, she's done. And it's been, oh, I don't know, 20 minutes. Yep. 
Boom. I had to get up and leave twice. And Billy had to get up and leave twice and his palm is done. There she is. Hi, McKenna. Say hey, baby girl. McKenna says no. So, there we go. You're done, sweet girl. Not bad, huh? What you doing, huh, baby? Mm -hmm. I like her.